Yo, yo, what up, what up, man? Thank you so much for dropping by. I'm just about to dive right in, man. So, I know a lot of people may have heard about this game, or a lot of people may have not heard about this game. Atomic Hearts, man. Yes, this game is about to drop into Game Pass Day 1, man. Another banger man i'm talking about it's just banger after banger after banger as boss and uncle phil continues to bring you value in game pass man no matter what the sony ponies all of the fanboys are talking all that garbage and all that trash about how good ps5 is you don't see this type of value coming to playstation i'm sorry it's just not you know, and I'm not saying that I don't like PlayStation games because I do like PlayStation AAA bangers. I just don't rock with Sony. I don't like the way they do their own fan base. So, man, this right here is a RPG uh, action role playing game, man. Uh, uh, first person shooter. Um, and I already know in the West, we love first person shooter games, man. This is going to be a beast. Um, I can't wait. It's an adventure game, fighting game that i know many of us are going to love the graphics look hot the animation everything about this game looks good so it's it's, it's different and i think it's made even by a russian studio now that is crazy ain't that's a coincidence man like we supposed to have stalker 2 i think drop in the game pass that's made by a ukraine studio and i think Atomic Hearts is made by a Russian studio. Now that is just crazy. But when it's about gaming, we all come together as brothers and sisters. So we leave everything else behind, man. So it's just at some point, the fanboys and the Sony ponies have to see the value in Game Pass. And they're going to have to give Xbox their credit where credit is due. That is all that the community is asking and they act like they just don't see it like it's just banger after banger now i don't know if it's due to numbers they feel like oh the ps5 is out selling the xbox is selling like hotcakes but this is the first time that xbox is actually competing and trying to win their fan base back since the 360 era pretty much so they're actually going toe to toe with sony and that's what they don't like sony don't want competition and again that's why they're trying to block the whole entire call of duty activision blizzard deal because we already know once xbox buys call of duty activision every game that activision ever made is going to drop into game pass day one and then you're going to get an annual release either every year of call of duty or every other year with all of the DLCs, with all of the marketing rights. And that's what Sony doesn't want to lose. They don't want to lose the marketing rights for Call of Duty. Now, Game Pass brings you value for people that don't want to waste their money and spend $70 on broken games that only run at 70, 20, you know, 30 FPS. Nobody wants to waste their money on a broken game that's garbage boring open world games life for spoken you know low metacritic score nobody likes this game they wish they can get their refund but you already spent your money you wish you can go trade it in for something like this for something like a game pass and that's why you got me man to keep dropping these updates for you guys so you guys can click the link down below and jump into the xbox ecosystem right now with game pass ultimate you know don't matter if you have a mobile phone you don't even need a console to actually jump into the xbox ecosystem now for playstation to play playstation games on playstation plus premium and some of their triple a bangers you're going to need a pc or a laptop and you're going to need an ethernet cable to get the full experience so you don't experience lag and input lag because you don't really want to run off of wi-fi you know you want to have a direct cable with the ethernet cable plugged into your laptop or your desktop to give you the best experience while you're gaming trust me i know i do it all the time so i just wanted to touch on that guys and bring you guys an update on atomic hearts will be dropping on the 21st i, I want to say the 21st let me go back and check uh i think it's on the 21st of this month yeah so on the 21st you guys can jump into that on xbox xbox series s and x pc mobile 
um i want to say even if you have a smart tv that that's capable of downloading game pass any way you can jump into the game pass ecosystem with your steam decks any anything your tablets your mobile phones your consoles your pcs you can play this game day one on game pass that's something that these ponies are mad about they know sony ain't trying to bring them no value they been getting shanked and juke those decepticons over there at sony all they do is steal from their fan base and that's why i don't rock with sony you know i'm trying to bring you guys value so you don't get ripped off by company greedy grimy shady scheming companies like that man so um, make sure you guys smash that like, that subscribe button, click that notification bell, man, so you guys can be notified on all of the new latest and greatest news out here in these gaming streets, man. And if you like to jump into the PlayStation ecosystem, the Xbox ecosystem, um, if you like to order merch, games, or, you know, buy things, just click the links down below in the description. Thank you and peace.